Yeah, well, th thanks for coming along this morning. Um, it's the last bit of the fixturing for the year to be released, the domestic schedule. A lot of really exciting things happening with the schedule. More day-night um, shield matches, a return of one-day domestic games to the WACA, which is great for our members and the public, uh, as well as um, the Women's National League starting much earlier in preparation for the Women's Big Bash League. Yeah, it's really exciting to have Matador Cup matches back here. Uh, we've, whilst we've understood why they've been played on the East Coast, we've continually advocated the need for them to be brought back um, to the home states at some point. Uh, so we're having five matches this year, three featuring WA and two um, independent matches. Um, so quite a lot of cricket for um, the public in WA to see, but a good chance for our Western Australian team to get a bit of a home ground advantage. Yeah, the day nights fixtures, uh, we've got round one here as a day night fixture and then round five just before um, the Big Bash League starts. Um, I think we all recognise that um, day night first class cricket is n not going to go away. So the more we can play, the better we're going to be. And the more practice we can get at this ground with our players um, we're really happy about but uh, as you know India has now adopted day-night test cricket so um, we'll see more and more of it at shield level.